Good morning, dears. We are going to talk about the Basque Economic Agreement, important um, issue of Basque history, recent history, and uh, we will talk about it uh, in three chapters. Rough concert and agreement, um, maybe the, um, chapter number one. It is usually spoken and more so in the age of Facebook and Twitter in terms of slogans and, simpli and simplified words and ideas. Something that, uh, by the way, uh, Juan Carlos Monedero defended as an authoritarian way of acting. And uh, the devil is sorry in the details, but the ideas in the nuances where one finds the truth of reality since most of the time situations are neither black or white and uh, as i will say uh, the cabinet of president uh, josiah barnett two days um, when there is a uh, black or white the situation ends with deaths on the table or with three kidnapped journalists fortunately the palette uh, has a large uh, plethora of intermediate colors, and that is um, where dialogue uh, should be established, the meeting point um, between different people, but uh, to achieve it um, everyone must take steps, and if not, uh, that agreement becomes unviable. The Canary Islands were, like Navarre, conquered by blood and fire. First, in the Canary Islands, around the period um, of 1492, although as later with um, the wars that, among others, uh, Pedro Esarte describes in the brief history of the conquest of Navarra, 1512-1530, uh, the issue took a while to, uh, to yell as something typical of Castilla. Um, and um, in the list of uh, Constitution of Cadiz, in 1812, it is referred uh, from its Article 10 uh, that is not only recognized as African territory but as colonial territory, and this is what Antoni Cubillo would have achieved and um, had he not been taken by an attack um, by the state's um, sewers uh, when he tried to introduce the Canary Islands. The into the United Nations the colonization, the colonization list. Why are we talking about the Canary Islands? Because it has a particular and particular system which is called the REF in the Spanish, which uh, unlike uh, the concert and the agreement system, and uh, since 1997 has been included in European legislation at um, that time under the premise of a certain Jose Maria Aznar, supposedly the uh, scourge of uh, all nationalisms. The same Aznar would force in 2002 the assumption of powers in health and education by all the communities that have no requested it. I mean the regions in Article 2, nationalities and regions. Hmm? And uh, there are two methods of to undermine the will to self-government. One, extend the power to everyone, equalize. And second, and normally in parallel, remove powers from everyone not uh, formally, but uh, moving the grass and the food, which is what the government of Mariana Rajoy has done is and, and is doing, with issues uh, such as the so-called national security law, ignoring that uh, what, um, when the crisis um, of the great rains um, of uh, 1983 occurred, all the forces, Basque or state, and they places themselves under the orders of Lendakari Karikotsea, army included. Now they want to turn the tables. May all forces be put at the service of the president of the government of Spain, and in that the autonomous is something auxiliary a more administrative decentralization, returning political power to the center. And that's where what each person can afford comes into play, because money is what gives independence. It is often said that the Canary Islands are outermost and in 
this lie because it is located at the meeting point of three continents such as America, Africa and Europe. It w it, if it was the launching point of Columbus mission to the new continent that uh, fact should be updated an element to consider in the strategic importance of the archipelagic islands it is located next to the African coast and uh, could become a pole of wealth creation and beneficial power for all African continents continental countries such as the power that South Africa exercises in the southern corn but uh, and here comes the problem is that to achieve this you do not necessarily have to be a Spanish Canadian especially if Spanish state denies him all the tours all the potential usually it can also be said that the Canary Islands are an archipelagic that um, they are islands and that is why they should be compensated. Well, there are more islands of European ownership, and um, while it is uh, true that the Azores Islands join their own tax regime with a ruling from the European courts, Corsica, Sardinia, Sicily, and the island of Man are also islands or the Balearic Islands, which um, do not enjoy even a similar status and appear together by towns in Palencia and Catalonia, the Catalan countries, among those uh, territories that always um, give more money to the state than they receive. They are Spanish and it is hard for them to belong to that club. And the thing about youth peripheral, there are two models of belonging which um, are not usually counted. The Dutch Antilles um, recently had a referendum and um, it um, chose their own framework, framework of membership, both in the Netherlands and in the European Union, or the case of Greenland, which uh, is Danish uh, territory. But um, outside the European Union, there is no single way Although in the case of the Canary Islands, it is wanted to present itself that way. Claudio Sánchez Albornoz wrote that I told the president of the Basque government when I was president of the Republic in exile, speak Basque if you can, because the majority don't know it, but pay taxes like everyone else, Spaniards, collected in the Spaniards and the Euskaldunak by Sose Azurmendi, written in 1976, and which could only seem the light in 1994. There is the key, not only mm, from the those um, of some, but also from a certain conception of federalism in Spain, still cultural competences even in education, sport, folklore, uh, folkloric arts, and linguistic policy. But Oh, you don't play with money. They're all the same. That is why there are movements not only to raise the amounts of the Basque and Navarrese quotas, but also to try, as in the past, to destroy both systems, always with the strange idea that supposedly it would be not mm, not modern, but it could uh, be European, and it would then be the coolest thing when it is democratic, it is European, and it is modern, a system that others tend to imitate. Some of them who will not do it should look for and read in a so called in Spanish El Yermo by Christian Campos. Very revealing reading. Although it is supposed uh, to be known, but uh, of course, if one begins by wanting to ignore that um, that Basque economic agreement includes solidarity mechanisms with other territories of the Spanish states, the concert, the agreement system are risk systems. They are not salvageable. You stick with what you have, like 
any other tax and fiscal system in the world. It is not in vain that Nakari Arnaz, the vice president, when the European family still had only 12 members, stated that our bus system was the 13th system. Then Austria, Finland and Sweden would enter in the European Union in 1995. By the way, Austria would um, share with Germany, German language, but um, does not share a common state. Finland, which has um, most opposed um, Cyprus uh, claims, and uh, which is um, the first cousin of Estonia, um, Estonia which um, 25 years ago then under the Soviet boot, um, and this um, year coal leads uh, grown in the European Union and Sweden, which, what a coincidence, the current reigning dynasty arises from a Napoleonic officer, friend to be exact, placed in that crown by the brilliant Corsican, a native of the city of Pau, that is, the town where the Parliament of Navarre is located. Of course, my friend Beloki says that is an, uh, an institution, not a legislative, uh, judiciary instead. But it's important in the term of Navarre put on the building. So that is the origin of that uh, current Sude Sweden, Swedish mm, uh, royal dynasty and is located, yes, in the old kingdom of Navarre. And there are um, medium-sized um, countries which survive, and survive well, without depending on others, and within the European Union. But let's go back to the line, and they are risk systems, because um, what one earns must be granted than um, what uh, one spends. Is um, that how it works? Although there are a number of caveats, which uh, will be explained later, there are then uh, people who have a pretty terminated mental shame, and uh, the framework of the Spanish state is unique, monolithic, and um, they are only capable of seeing um, an immutable state. As um, if, uh, let's refer to the book Spaniards Who Could Not Be by the Norbert Carlist, uh, my friend Jose Antonio Yatef Abo, who explains that the American independence of the first third of the 19th century was not inevitable, as was not the case in Cuba later, because um, they asked for more autonomy within the framework of the state, and by the time the state thought um, they, that they could uh, grant it ready to the color recognition, the Cubans were no longer interested and were looking um, for something more lasting, such as independence. And um, it is uh, worth remembering that uh, no territory that, that has advanced in the assumption of more self-government of sovereignty has regressed uh, from those achieved achievements. Uh, there is the least from the 19th century to the 20th century, but also in the 21st century, there are people then who are incapable of visualizing the existence of composite states, of plurinational states, of recognizing that the Spanish constitution, in addition to the Spanish nation, recognizes within itself four nationalities and 13 regions, and that is not bad but on the country reaching and what uh, composite states there are in Europe and in the world and that is um, this globalization and modernity recognize the differences neither better nor worse we are simply different and between different people it is necessary to agree meet agree Spain is not um, an objective reality Everything is a social construct, because um, there is no nation without its peoples. There is no country without humanity. Homeland is humanity. It is human collectives that make the nation and the laws. And the legitimacy, the legitimacy that arises from the people is more powerful than any law, since um, the law does not emanate from any god.
but from human beings, antimation belongs to the living, and as a living body, it is mutable, and it can change. What are the caveats mentioned? Well, surely it has not been thought often, but the same thing that the state does not allow the regional, cha the regional chambers to legislate and adapt the European Union directives and regulations, unlike states such as Austria, Germany, the United Kingdom, Belgium, and others. Is it possible that the money coming from the European Union for matters of autonomic, autonomic applications is counted? as money that the state receives and transfers to the autonomous framework, including the provincial framework of the four system of source and scale bus count, and uh, that is that the money for an exclusive competences such as active and passive employment policies, and which was the subject of a transfer of competence in 2010-2011, negotiated by then past shadow government by Inigo Urcullu and Josu Arcoreca, with the agreement between Italy, France, Spain and Germany few years ago. The transfer of capital was made to the state, and the funds were retained there. This principle may have been used when preparing these fiscal balances, something to take into account, for example, with um, the whole issue of the high-speed train as its flagship. Now, let us remember, the statute of bus counting is not fulfilled in its Article 18-2b, and in transitional fifth which uh, clearly speak of the economic regime of social security, which must be transferred. And it has not been done in the current um, 40 years, and it is an organic law of the state, the kind that when they swear to comply and enforce the constitution and the laws, it is perjured, it is perjury. But uh, who is going to condemn them to that within the framework of the state, when no one has dared to condemn the exchange of Almeria as unconstitutional within the framework of the constitution of Andalusian autonomy? Don't think that autonomy itself can suffer more from unconstitutionality, at least in, in its foundations, in one, in the Almeria one, because the one in Jaén could be solved without compromises. Susana Diaz has already said that Andalusia will be used by her and the PSOE to blackmail the rest of nationalities and regions about the possible future framework. The same thing they used um, new Andalusian, Andalusian statute of 2006 to try to bridle the new Catalan statute um, at the same time, and then they will say from themselves and humanity, oh no, they put Spain in the middle, for themselves, for Spain and humanity. The framework of the Spanish state will either be clearer or it will not be, or it will be composite or will not be. It could be called federal, confederal, voluntary, asymmetrical, but the basis must, must be found in the extension of the federal framework of spending to income. That, um, that is the double question of the voluntariness of all the self-government that one requests, as long as one can pay it. In the Basque framework, the regular one, of the four territories, the formula resolves um, and revolves among um, not imposing, not impeding neither me over you nor you overcome me. It is often forgotten that it is a formula that bins both parties, not just in both parties, and if there is no militarity it is the part of the state that would be breaking the deck 
and leaving full freedom to the other to enforce the sovereign will of its citizens. And it is in this context of possible constitutional change or reform that Albornoz's words resurface, but um, with other nu nuances and by other means, Basque culture, well, yes, tolerated, but okay, but um, the money for the state, without uh, wanting to understand that composite states can have composite realities on the islands and on the continent that no distinctions can be made. And when they say that Basques and Navarrese pay little, first the figures deny it, if there they are studies seriously, and second, that in this is decided in mixed concert and agreements, commissions, between the state and the corresponding regional community. Because as Jose Enrique Serrano recognizes, there are two regional communities, and not just one. And that, if we talk about the suppression of concert and that agreement, which on the other hand would not be a novelty in the history of the state, remember that until 1839 the commercial borders were on the Ebro River and that Navarre is it its own currencies, that um, is that economic and monetary unit of the state in historical terms is from the day before yesterday. Spanish unity in monetary issues uh, were from um, 1869 to 1999, 130 years. Only that. Must immediately demand, without further consideration, the suppression of the royal mm, regime in Canary Islands. and and any auxiliary system that accompanies in that Canary Archipelagic Islands. And there is no need to compare, compensate anything. Well, before that RIF, R-E-F in Spanish, in the Canary Islands, the law on the free ports, British-inspired law, already existed. Likewise, also in the Canary Islands, what the needs to be compensated is not what they say, but something else. And there is that manual for knowledge of the archipelagic islands, such as um, the book Canarias con Futuro by the Canary Islands economist, my friend Jorge Dorta. The Canary Islands for the Basque Country and Navarre are three elements of the same reality the one that points um, to the state and um, as um, the point one th that must define who is and what it wants to be for the future so what uh, the rest uh, of us um, can finally know the terrain and the soil on which that we meet second chapter Basco agreement or canary r e f the economic system of Canary Islands. He imagines that when his salary arrives at his house, at the beginning or end of the month in a six-story building, six <coughs> plants story building, with two neighbors on the ground floor, four per floor, and a luxurious penthouse Madrid, of course, he would live at the trance. A doorman who receives his salary, along with that of the other families, and who will be in charge of distributing it as he pleases. Fortunately, in that building called Spain, it is the Basque family and the Navarrese family they manage their own resources, because they can, and because they want to. And because it is a sustainable system over time and financially. A system of its own, certainly, like um, there are a few in the world, although with frameworks of a certain similarity in Azor Islands or um, in California, where the political will of um, 
their um, um, their living is um, or their living together is superior um, to the political will to win and achieve supremacy in a zero sum game in which um, to reaffirm oneself one must necessarily deny others an example of this is the so-called spanish nation which excludes and ignores other nations that are within it such basques catalonia which moreover spill over onto the other side of the pyrenees within the french states and the spanish constitution speaks about um, nationality and regions and uh, the first additional provision speaks of a recognition of respect on the regional framework from Biscay, Navarre, Araba and Gipuzkoa and uh, within that forum is the Basque Economic Agreement. Now let's change reality. Imagine a territory as geographically far from Spain as Helsinki is. A territory with enormous potential but that never materializes a place in which uh, potentialities are not developed because there are interests that prevent them from developing a place where there are no businessmen but green extractors and where the native population is kept on the margins of development opportunities a territory that believes it has to live of societies but in which most of the economic activity generated and produced in that territory is not taxed there but in other places. A territory in which the official accounting says that it has a large deficit but in which if the economic activity generated in that territory were taxed there as is in the case in Basque um, Agreement it will be practically imbalanced and all this despite to be one of the autonomous communities that has grown the least in the, in the last uh, 25 years since the bureaucratic and leg legislative framework prevents diversification, innovation and growth. That economic territory is the Canary Islands. Before the first Basque Economic Agreement of 1878, Navarra's contribution had already existed since 1841. First there was the contribution and then the economic agreement. According to the preamble of that law, once um, the proper functioning of the first Quintas military service was verified and the second ones were recruited. A concert, an agreement, was held in pursuit of unific unification with the rest of the state administrations. The concert, the agreement, was imposed by force of arms against the country with a permanent occupation army of about 40,000 troops. Certainly, until that moment, the regime was different. Well, there was a kind of concert agreement, but voluntarily and with completely different tax templates, like um, two different countries under the same sovereign and with voluntary contributions as happened in the period between the two laws abolishing the charters, that of the 1839 and that of 1876. Even so, there has always been a thread of uninterrupted for a community and the agreement Siamese Brothers in Basque side, Navarre side is its current strongest death threat. From that year 1878 onwards, after the lack of data and documentation of possible Basque taxpayers and the need of the abolition of the general meetings to have control and administration instruments, the so-called compromised deputations ended up understanding to need the drive a procedure that was initially temporary and become something more elaborate that over time and successive negotiations expanded and took on its own body and that 
prevented it from being eliminated in its entirely during the long, dark years of Franco's dictatorship, ruling only in uh, Alaba and Navarre. When Suárez, Spanish president, was um, determined to resign, he addressed the restoration of that concert for Biscay and Guipúzcoa, suppressed in 1930. Seven, by Dirtu of the Lao. Of conquest. The Lao of conquest. Against the Trailers provinces, the Coup d'etat and subsequent civil war. The fiscal species specific is and uh, commercial freedoms for the Canary Islands are based on their own historical justification and the facts of conquest. But um, in the first decades of the 19th century, a protectionist economy policy was imposed in Spain that soon to cushion the effects of the loss of the American colonies and weaken the flow of precious metals with which uh, manufacturers were paid for. Uh, to prevent uh, the trade deficit from accumulating uh, and uh, to stimulate uh, national manufacturing and uh, import uh, tariff was created in 1821. The consequences for the Canary Islands, which had never been integrated into the Spanish economy, were disastrous for decades. Not only were imports from Spain or poorer quality and more expensive than foreign ones, but the Canary Islands also lost exports to European markets due to their retaliation to Spanish protectionist measures, without any industry being able to be created. The Canary Islands were an internationalist economy that um, Spanish protectionist measures removed from international internationalization for the first time. This creates a serious crisis in the Canary Islands that will only be to be overcome after the decree creating the free ports, that is a free trade zone starting in 1852 and its enshrinement uh, in the free ports law of 19 in um, 1900. In the period between 18, 19, uh, in 1852 and the beginning of the First World War is the period of splendor of the Canary Islands within the framework of the First Globalization. The Canary Islands are integrated into international trade flows. It is the time in which um, ports and electricity companies were created. Banana and tomato crops were introduced as well as the creation of room factories. This um, development came uh, hand in hand with English and native investments, mainly remittances from emigrants in Cuba and Venezuela, which uh, even allowed uh, the creation of an incipient financial sector in the Canary Islands. England did more for the Canary Islands in 50 years than Spain did in five centuries. The English influence is such that after the disaster of the 98th in the 19th century, the Canary Islands were not incorporated into the United States because the English already controlled the Canary Islands. Since the Spanish Civil War, the things being to change uh, my Canary commercial freedoms gradually erode. For example, before Franco, Bananas were exported uh, on any ship, especially on the English shipping companies that uh, made the journey linking, linking South Africa or uh, South America with the United Kingdom. Franco to pay favors uh, to the March Bank forces the bananas uh, to be ships um, on March ships. And these arrived in worse condition and their destination than the South American bananas from the United Fruit Company, which meant um, that a lot of market was lost. Starting in the uh, 16th um, century, in the 16th decade, in 19th in, in, in century, sorry, start, <laughs> starting in the 1960s, a series of reforms began 
that uh, continued uh, the deterioration of commercial freedoms in the Canary Islands. First, the tariff law of 1960. Then, the REF of uh, 1972, the system of economic agreement with Canary Islands, and later full integration into the European Union, make the Canary Islands increasing dependence of Spain while the rest of the state has become increasing internationalized um, since um, the end of Franco's autarky and dictatorship, the Canary Islands have followed to opposite direction. It has been taken out of globalization and turned into a captive market, which um, its legislative reform, commercial dependence on Spain has expanded considerably so much so that in the 20th century imports from Spain they represented 12% of total canary imports at the beginning of the century. Today, in 21st century, they represent more than 90% without this being justified by Spanish international competitiveness. The Canary Islands today function as the Spanish Cuba of the 21st century, a place where on the one hand income from abroad is generated. In this cause, tourism, which helps compensate for the chronic trade deficit of the Spanish foreign balance, and on the other hand as a captive market in which to place the surpluses of Spanish industrial production and the, reputa the repudiations of agricultural productions that cannot be placed on in the international market. The economic agreement implies that the past administrations, especially the provincial councils, that has a treasury department similar that, um, to mm, that uh, of other states, this is why Lenacari Adanza, the past president, stated in 1993 that the Basques was the 13th largest tax system in then European Union. There are four Basque um, trade department, um, tre treasure department, um, not trade, sorry. There are four treasury departments in Basque land and in addition uh, to the neighboring uh, Spanish one, one for each um, provincial council. They collect all taxes, all taxes. It has been necessary to span its regulatory framework as um, the tax template has varied over time and even uh, new taxes have been created um, that have had uh, to be included in the agreement system. The commission in equal half bas representatives and half Spanish representatives and agreements must be adopted unanimously. Neither I over you, nor you over me. Do not prevent, do not impose. A path that does not resort to unilateralism, but rather to agreement. At an internal level, there is, um, together with the Arbitration Commission, a kind of Basque uh, constitution, um, arbit, um, constitutional judiciary instrument, the tax uh, coordination body, whose um, mission is to harmonize and coordinate the taxation of the councils. It is um, in the vast uh, finance council where it is decided how much will be collected and then uh, how that money is distributed and the different levels of, of government, the local level, the provincial councils themselves and the vast government and the provincial councils have effective protection of the vast municipalities. Ah, the concert laws is a single article and therefore has the same treatment as the international treaties that the Spanish state may sign, which uh, reflects a trace of original sovereignty and deeply differentiated and own realities. The Spanish constitution of 1978 recognizes in its additional provision 3 the existence in the Canary Islands of a special regime for the islands. This regime can be expanded on reduced as um, the discretion 
of the state legislator that is to say the canary islands economic and fiscal regime the so-called ref is not a right as is in, in historical jurisdictions but a concession that the state makes as um, it um, win uh, and that it can expand or reduce as it seems fit. Furthermore, since it does not constitute a right, the IREF is approved for a period of five years, with uh, keeps um, it mirrored in a constant transients and uncertainly that prevents among many other factors it um, from functioning and uh, something effective for the creation and of development in the Canary Islands. Therefore the REF is mainly a series of fiscal measures, both in the creation of local uh, taxes, in the creation of certain tax benefits negotiated with Madrid for a period of five years. The Canary Islands also do not have their own treasury as in the case of the Basque Concert, the Basque Economic Agreement, so that the economic activity generated in the Canary Islands is taxed in the Canary Islands. Although this has been an historical demand of Canarian nationalism, surely Madrid has been the main scourge against the concert system, but not forever, but rather from very specific dates that need to be understood to understand the subsequent evolution. Spanish nationalism that beams normatively with uh, the anti-foral and anti-Spanish constitution of Cadiz of um, 1812 is the beginning of a path that seeks uh, to standardize and centralize the Spanish state, laminating any difference that it finds in its path following the French Jacobin model since um, the so-called PEPA, it's uh, very Frenchy. Thus, um, administration and tax systems other than those uh, emanating from Madrid will be seen as enemies, and the so-called liberal, um, like the former party Ciudadanos, um, or progressive, populist, like um, the old party, because passed away, Podemos reproduce a sense typical of the beginning of the 19th century. Judgments like um, as the one in Azores, Archipelagic Islands, must have a right to establish the fit in the state and in the European Union framework of the legality and legitimacy of a system that will not be harmed by the so called European tax harmonization while in as um, this purse um, unification of rates, for example, the corporate tax or VAT within the European framework, a system with its uh, derivatives such as uh, tax holidays, which um, states uh, do within mooring, that uh, has um, had the paradox in the style of Alice in the Wonderland in which uh, the prosecutor and the defense lawyer were the same. The Spanish state, it seems that it is something of the past, since in principle the past institutions are in the um, European uh, Fiscal Financial um, Monetary uh, Ministers um, Council, despite uh, the a fact um, that the uh, Spanish government has never wanted to include concert agreement framework in any European Union core treaty. Until the so-called law of the uh, shielding of the concert and the agreement, the Basque Economic Agreement, as uh, the rules of operation and types were approved in general meetings and not um, in the Basque Parliament. The provincial states um, and their body are territorial, not um, of the vast uh, national level, and that is why the hierarchical rank of its legal emanations, despite covering the same procedure of, as any parliament law, have the rank of norm, the, um, and therefore until 2011, imputable by any administration, and even unions and individuals at the individual, individual level. The Spanish parties and institutions have been responsible for questioning the model before Spanish and European uses, 
and the response has been overwhelming and um, it's it is a legal system that will last as long as there is the will for it returning to the canary islands as uh, we have said previously the ref is not a right but a concession given by the state to the canary islands and therefore is not really designed for the development of the islands but rather to favor the economic political and geopolitical interest of the spanish state in the canary islands the ref is not um, an instrument for development for the canary islands but a colonial regime of domination at its core the ref are instruments designated to favor the interests of large spanish companies in the canary islands and a series of tax incentives to buy the loyalty of the local oligarchy. Furthermore, its permanent transitory nature and its renegotiation every five years is used as permanent blackmail by the um, Spanish state to buy loyalties and secure its agenda. All this means that REF contains the water Madrid and the Spanish state is interested in it containing What's more, the state complies and fails to comply at will. The state has never even respected Articles 95 and 96 of, of the proper REF, which require it to have a minimum level of invests in the Canary Islands equal at least to the state average. The Canary Islands is one of the communities with the least investment from the state but it is a net contributor to the state coffers it, if we take into account not only the budget deficit practically in balance but the criterion of monetary flow but the surplus of contributors to the social security the other leg of the canary islands legal framework is its relationship with europe the integration of the Canary Islands into the European Union was an imposed integration in the literal sense of the term. When the Parliament of the Canary Islands rejected on um, 22 of June um, 1985 the conditions set out for the islands in the Treaty of Accession of Spain into the Economic and uh, European Area um, for understanding that um, the central government had not adequately negotiated or defended our historical specifics despite um, the fact um, that the Aquis Communitaire um, has always um, accommodated the pre-existence special uh, regimes of the member states with um, some of their territories at the time of integration. However, this rejection by the Canary Islands Parliament was not taken into consideration. When said, the treaty was ratified days later by the Spanish Parliament, 12th of July 1985, despite the supposed warranties established in defense of um, Canary Islands special regime, both in the Spanish Constitution and in the Statute of Autonomy. What's more, the integration of the Canary Islands occurs under the Statute of Outermost Region, RUP instead of as an overseas country and territory, which would have been a regime more in the line with the traditional fiscal and commercial freedoms of the Canary Islands. With the decision of full integration into the European Economic Community of December 1989, forced the disastrous conditions hatched in 1985 for Canary agricultural sports. The customs exemptions um, that uh, were still maintained came to an end, applying the community tariff policy towards third parties in the islands, countries to the detriment of the commercial freedom and rearing by franchise, franchises and forcing the Canary Islands to buy items including essential items at uh, prices higher than international prices. Furthermore, its classification as a RUP 
plunges the Canary Island even farther into uncertainty since the creation of a permanent statute with the framework of the RUP is um, contrary to community law, something that could not happen if the Canary Islands were an overseas country and territory associated with the European Union, as in, in the case with um, 21 territories of the United Kingdom, the Netherlands or France. The Canary Islands are um, an example of how dangerous it can be to renounce the freedoms included in historical jurisdictions. Almost um, more than 50 years have passed since the first REF in 1920, uh, 1972, which uh, marked the beginning of the end of the Canary Freeports and their traditional customs and tax franchises. 20 years have passed uh, since uh, the integration of the Canary Islands into the European Union. The figures do not lie. Both the primary sector and the industrial sector, and finally the Canary financial sector, have been progressively dismantled, uh, turning the Canary Islands into a tourist colony. If the REF, in the Canary Agreement in Economy, and integration into the European Union as the RUP were designated in to favor the development of the Canary Islands, they have failed miserably. But uh, neither the REF nor the RUP status were chosen to favor the development of the Canary Islands but to favor the interest of the Spanish state and large Spanish company in Canary Islands. The so-called REC, for example, is an instrument that practically allows you to buy land and then deduct uh, in it uh, taxes incentives. That's what the possibilities are reduced to in the Canary Islands. The volume is cut off and opportunities are stopped. The only recourse is to sell the land like the natives locked up in the Iranian Reserve. The so-called REF is simply a mechanism for extracting rents which, um, together with fiscal transfer from the state and Europe, the only thing they have created is an extractive regime and client list networks in the Canary Islands, tax incentives and different instruments such as the Canary Islands Special Zone or the SIP Registry are not designed to be internationally competitive, but to encourage the establishment of Spanish companies in the Canary Islands. But as the economist Asimoglu and Robinson said, the extractive economy regime cannot be sustained in the air. It needs an equal extractive political regime to, stay, to sustain it. This extractive policy and political regime it is called the Canarian Electoral Law, with an electoral barriers of 30% of the island constituency, of or where the vote of a person on one island can be worth 12 times to the value of the vote of another island. Among many, sorry, among many other niceties that uh, would be long to say, list and list. That, uh, that's how subtropical and banana oriented the Canarian um, electoral regime is. On the other hand, tax benefits and exemptions serve to buy the loyalties of the small local oligarchy. When Amaharaja rebelled in the British Empire in India, England allowed him to impose a tax on his own people to get them loyal. Something similar happens in the Canary Islands. A tax here, a tax extension here. The REF is basically that uh, the creation of extractive bridge bars, cliently networks, and incentives for large Spanish companies that operate in the Canary Islands. Very crude and manifestly false questions are often said about the Basque Economic Agreement. It is accused of overfinancing, having money is not guarantee of good management, as uh, demonstrated by countries with abundant oil or gas, of uh, being to transfer to the Basque National Party 
given the Second Republic does not recognize said um, poorly the agreement. Or to ETA, it is an element of stability and connection to Spain, something that matters little to a revolutionary Marxist organization. Fortunately, this man did. Or uh, so many others that uh, a serious and calm reading denies and dismantles. And doubly, in the Basque Country and Navarre, in southern Basque Country, because there is a northern Basque Country in Sp uh, the state of France, there is a better standard of living than in other territories of the Spanish state. The agreement system is an unparalleled told, but neither more nor less than that an instrument. There are other reasons for its as usefulness and success in these times. One must have the autonomy and self-government that one can afford in one's economic and financial stability. Living beyond you means is a risk you cannot take. This is why political will must be supported by the capacity to collect and manage one's own resources, without forgetting solidarity with others. It might surprise you, but mm, the agreement, Basque economic agreement system, is perfectly exportable to anyone who wants it. The quota is based on the payment of 6.24% of the powers not transferred and managed by the state in the Basque territory. That is why the sum of all the territories equals 100. It is a political question, just like calling from below is a crime. If something has to be done, it is to provide better mechanisms to those who lack them and not take them from whoever owns them and even more so when, as a result of the bungles of the ticket from 2007 and two in uh, 2017 in the regional financing model, it has caused in the 15 autonomies of the common regime there is a joint debt that exceeds 200 billion euros toward the state. 2017 will will be a year in which the quota contribution and financing system of the common regime autonomies would have been to be reviewed, but um, not uh, it was not uh, reviewed. It is a serious and delayed problem, also in 2024, where it would have been and other point to be actualized. That the life problem is a political problem and it must be resolved in principle with common sense and with responsibility. Any attack on the agreement and the contribution and on the Basque economic agreement and the quota would mean at worst the destabilization of the relations in between Basques and Spaniards, and at the um, least a significant uh, reduction in the financing of public services in the Basque Country and Navarre. It means attacking the weakest layers of Basque society, which are the ones that benefit the most from the current concert, the Basque Economic Agreement. And the proof of the stability is that while the regional system has had one methodology the general one has had seven, all of them failed, and an eight must be found after the patches that is not satanic, as Cristina Cifuentes defined at the time current. A curious, that is, Andalusian Corinthians Moreno Bonilla, will be the one to describe Madrid as a tax heaven. After all, Spain is different. Third, a final chapter, concept and quota, commitment to citizens. 
without a doubt, the lack um, of willingness on the part um, of some uh, to make themselves understood about the reality of things is surprising, especially those who beat in their chats in defense of the Constitution in capital letters, bold and underlined, forgetting those articles that bother them the most, such 9, 10, 92, 150, the first additional, the second transitional, and the fourth, or the second derogatory, the system of concert and agreement, contribution and quota are in the constitution, yours, everyone's, as a factor of that formally, formality that protects and respects. It is a fact that exists and that furthermore is easily explainable. All you have to do is go, if you want to read, to website of the economic concert, the Basque economic agreement and download the book of, of the length you want. There are three models, I suggest personally the one with 3,122 3, pesos, which um, is like reading a two-month uh, newspaper, that's all. Or look for the lectures on uh, YouTube on the subject uh, by Pedro Luis Uriarte. Honestly, there is true information, but we are going to try to explain a series of concepts if possible. Where is um, the, What is the Basque quota? The quota is the receipt of the system. It is uh, the cause and origin, but now it has become a consequence, there will be time to clarify that. Not, um, it does um, not depend on feedback agreements, it has not been contra-proposal by budgets or anything similar. When it's time, it's time, unless one of the parties refuses to negotiate, because that's what bilateral agreements are like. One does not negotiate if the other knows, does not want to, and there is no agreement unless both agree. Unity, unilateralities outside, dialogue, agreement and negotiation. This is how it is established. Theme seemed to remember that in 2001 facing 2002 there was not precisely a favorable agreement with the popular party and an agreement was reached because um, it had uh, to be reached, and the same thing happens when it's time to renew the five years uh, coup allows. Uh, what uh, are the five years quote allows? Well, simply an update of the invoice that uh, must be paid annually to the state, not only for the services provided in the Basque Country, which would have a certain logic, but for those powers not transferred to the Basque Country, regardless of where they are performed. It is picturesque to hear about um, their reimbursement uh, for the Gibuscoan branch advance uh, with uh, Basque funds as a privilege. When thought uh, 6.24%, uh, we have paid paid the spiners um, 6.24 percent of all high-speed installations in all the state of Spain and without having a single active kilometer here in Basque land. So we have paid for the high velocity trains but uh, more than enough. They don't see the part of the equation just as the forecast is made for um, is, is made of uh, what income uh, and expenses may be but then year by year it is evaluated and this is how the five years law, laws that could uh, not be approved in past in 2007 2011 2012 2017 now we have allow enforced um, for 2022 for 2026 have revealed that it was overpaid and that must be reimbursed to those who paid more 
that is in the final settlement but this also happens with a budget in a year there are three active budgets one is uh, the one that is being prepared two the one that is being executed and three the one that is uh, being liquidated that of uh, next year that of the current year and that of last year it would be common sense why five year quota allows because that's how it is established the concert the basque economic agreement system since 2002 has been indefinite indefinite and by symbiosis the agreement and contribution follow the same path when the new quota and concertation laws are approved, the equivalent will be same with the government of Navarre, which, by the way, uh, when one signs a bilateral agreement, as uh, when, they, when, when you agree to a mortgage with the bank, the last thing you want is for a third party to get involved. Hence, uh, the approval system in Congress is the same as international treaty. The system or is how the collection and management of the treasury is ordered, the relational framework. But everything that is not assumed, perhaps um, a rent uh, to the state um, for its services, must be updated. But in the medium term, in a period that uh, is uh, neither too short, not too long, and it is remembered regardless of political cycles. Of uh, course, of course, it should be clear that uh, to have credibility, someone who has issues as important as this pending must resolve this first uh, before addressing other things, and uh, so it was done. Temporal coincidence, not cause and effect, between Basque negotiation and state uh, annual budget. But if the concert, the Basque Economic Agreement, is indefinite, why did um, it have to be reevaluated year by year in several um, periods? Because the concert and agreement uh, system is a system which um, all taxes are managed in past territorial provinces, Araba, Biscay, Navarra, and Guipúzcoa and half of them are governed by state regulation and the other half by regulatory capacity in Basque institutions. Sometimes it happens that um, there are new taxes, society evolves, and there are, these uh, new taxes must be incorporated into the concerted in the Basque economic agreement uh, system, so that the Basque states are the ones who order and collect those taxes. And that is precisely what happened in those years in the 21st century, many times. Unfortunately, and due to the lack of desire to explain what the concert and the quota are, simply a different system, a different administration, the part is used for the whole, and instead by going and to the concrete, and the entire system is put on the table as something debatable and discussed. Obviously, there is no mention of the common regime system, which um, is under uh, the more than 92% of the Spanish population, governments, and govern, pe govern people, mm, in which, um, unlike um, the concept and agreements, which uh, continues with the same successful methodology since 1981, has seen almost one failure, dozens of methodologies and there has been more than three years of in unspeakable extension in the model more than three and more than 15. Last uh, common model of um, uh, this uh, framework was in 2009 to be renewed, not done in 2014, not done in 2019, and who knows in 2024. We will see. What is the Basque Economic Agreement? 
until 1878, the Basque Country did not pay taxes, they say. Yes, that about the exempt provinces. Well, that's a lie, like San Mamés when he grew up. Of course, the Basques paid taxes. The point is that the king's treasury, that of the state, did not know anything, nor did it have any information about the Basque taxpayers. And furthermore, each one of them handled different tax templates. It was the provincial fact in all the fullness event despite the law abolition of 1839, which was um, clinched by that of um, 1876. By the way, both uh, abolition laws are definitely replaced by the Spanish Constitution of 1978. So that opens the door to what is known of full floral restoration, that is the status prior to the 19th century in Basque land, still to be addressed, although maybe one day. It would be interesting to find a case of a country in which, after having lost three Carlist War civil wars, we might say, that is um, that three civil wars with uh, international overtones, to Basque it is prevailed by force of arms with more than 40,000 soldiers as an occupating force, constitutional guarantees suspended, a gift of the proportion of the Basque economic agreement is given, and on top of that is this considered a privilege graciously given to the defeated, to the humiliated, to whom they have attempted to strip their privileges, that is, uh, its constitutional framework to oppression. It is clear that originally it was not what it is now, but as Frances P. Margal would say, taking away rights from the Basques made them better and more enthusiastic Spaniards. Of course not, they were compromised deputations handpicked by Madrid who in the first renewal of the concert in, 19, in 1886, in 19th century, and with the support of Queen Maria Cristina, refused to abandon that provisional system that has been consolidated over time in different frameworks, such as it was even in the detectorship of Primo de Rivera, with certain Jose Calvo Sotelo, was a minister of finance paying high price to the concerted the Basque economic agreement system, it has been the nobility of the Basque leaders of all times and all colors who have defended this secular system that today enjoys good health also in Navarre. So why do the Basques have this system and others don't? Simply because that's how history has been, and the will of each one it's a tool, nothing more, nothing less. It requires a strong institutional and social fiscal commitment, healthy administrations, and that has not always been favorable. But the love for the land and its peoples, and the confidence that even though it is a unilateral risk system in which you have to pay independently of the income time that can be generated, if there is any. For the keeping the farms here in proximity, something that is now within the European Union framework known as subsidiarity, and could be the mirror in which to look at the European Union's relationship with the member states. Catalonia could have had a similar system because until the second half of the 1980s the scope of the first regional additional provision was not limited to the territories of the Basque Country and Navarre. That um, 1980, shortly before the approval of the so-called Love Cup, it was uh, offered to Catalonia, which rejected it. And in 1996, concern arose in part of um, convergence of Catalonian um, citizens, um, so-called few, 
that in the Majestic Pact included some of these. And Puyol, the president then of the Catalonian community, did not want to. We had to wait until 2012 for an attempt of a fiscal pact, which did not suit Madrid. It is worth remembering that in 2000, a prestigious Spanish economic magazine asked the 15 conciliars of the common regime communities if they wanted a system like Basque economic agreement system. They said known. Known and the Catalan was called Artur Mas after, in 2012, the president of the Catalonian community. How does the agreement and quota work with respect to the common regime communities? No way. They are two systems without communicating vessels of any kind. The Basque Country and Navarre collect their taxes based on their capacity and their regulations, and the state collects in the rest of the communities. Catalonia, for example, collected before the start of the process five euros for every 100 greener generated for by natural and legal persons, only 5%. Taking into account the state's investments, the return to Catalonia was 45 euros, 55 stayed in Madrid. Yes, Madrid is the true tax haven in Spain, and an economic vacuum cleaner that has not stopped to grow at the expense of nationalities and regions yes also at the expense of the concerted ones the quota is paid religiously but then, then the state does want it considers it is not a final payment thus it is evident that uh, what it is contributed by the quota is much higher than any state intervention in Basque territory, and yet there has been no compliance, since it is a contribution to solidarity. Uh, oh, but uh, wait, does the concert system include interterritorial system solidarity? Well, of course, uh, we, the Basques, pay 6.24% of the same fund with great pressure. What is little solidarity? Well, that's easy to solve. You don't have to touch a single coma. Let the state increase the amount of that fund, and we, Basque, will have to pay more based on that index of 6.24% which is the percentage of impact of the Basque economy on the state one, in the Spanish state one. Although in recent times it has been more like at 6.10%. But well, it is not worth entering into that debate as we are 4.5% by population, a criterion used in the common regime financing system. Obviously, solidarity should, be, should not be unlimited and be reflected in data, such as um, that of Ireland after most, um, almost 40 years of European funds after its accession to the European communities. It is not the same Ireland. It's not the same Ireland. Uh, a test um, that um, some common regime communities may not want to do for themselves. Without going much further, and without wanting to be bored, um, the two main accusations of the um, parties um, in Spain are funny. One, the evident opacity, when the system cannot be more transparent, and any school child uh, can make and understand the calculation of the quota to pay from the Basque community as long as there is a desire to understand it and two, the excess of complexity in the laws as it telling, uh, if telling the Spanish that um, they are too stupid uh, to understand complex things and uh, that will be a defect. It only uh, excuses of those um, who uh, confuse unity with uniformity and centralism and even today believe that there can only be one of each, one law, one administration, one state, 
one language, one king, one government, one people, one state, one nation. If there are better social indicators than other autonomous communities, that is due to better management of scarce resources by vast institutions and um, any attack consequently both of the quota and the concert means attacking those who are receiving recipients of the 70% of the resources in the vast budget such as health, education and social services such as those most vulnerable sections of the population and that the concentrated system allows allow doing so has been the collective work of many people but it must be recognized um, at the political and ideological impulse of the Basque National Party that is the birth of Euskadi, the Basque Country the four provincial sisters we are our own separate system neither better nor worse if um, someone else wants it there will be half um, our blessing and moral, political and technical support I'm completely sure the problem arises from those who in order to assert themselves need to deny rights to others and on that side there is no option we will continue forward defending, explaining the vast economic agreement, the contribution and the quota as the right of the people, of each and every one of the citizens of the country, of the Basques, because the future is at stake in it. And as Shakespeare said, that is the unknown country in which we will spend the rest of our lives. So thank you very much for being here and wait for um, this moment and as we say in Basque, Esquerricasco, Agur Berobat, Betty Gelpian.